What is up guys, Pie Muffin here, and we are back with our SAO Rising Steel video. I am making another video concerning what came out today, because obviously due to the episode not being out, we didn't see everything last night when they revealed that we would be getting an Asuna. So uh, first things first, uh, this is the banner for the new Asuna, My Princess, which honestly doesn't make a lot of sense, that name there. But uh, anyways, I guess we'll just <laughs> go with that. I will not be summoning here because as I went over in my last video, uh, she's not a great unit. Her only real kind of perk is the fact that she has an incarnate that will boost your team's attack for uh, a couple of turns. But uh, other than that, she's really not that amazing of a unit. Uh, I still say that the water enhanced mode Adis is a much better charge unit. Um, but enough about that. We finally have chapter 13 in the game. So I guess because we're getting close to the end of the anime, probably here in like six or seven weeks. Um, five or six weeks, actually. Probably, I think we have six episodes left after today's. Um, I guess they're finally starting to put this stuff in here, which chapter 13 doesn't look like it's that long, uh, as you can see here. And then I assume, yep, it's got normal and hard mode. Um, so... For those of you who always say, you know, I don't have any gems, here's some gems to get. I mean, it's obviously not a ton, but, um, you know, what is that, like, six gems per story part? Um, so that's actually pretty short, actually, but at least it's something. Um, we'll start getting the story as time goes on. Um, the other thing is we do have the new ranking event. The my I still don't understand why it's called My Princess. Maybe the story portion will uh, make it make sense. But it is the ranking event we have been expecting, and water will obviously be the uh, helping factor here, um, which I obviously have to watch the first story part to even unlock the ranking part. But uh, with water being the element, I think my uh, Enhanced Mode Aedis will definitely be enough to help me get through this. And if you have Aedis and Enhanced Mode, Alice, um, you're going to do fine in this. You don't even need to summon for Austin, unless she's just like a favorite character. But by the way, her Incarnate does look great. Um, I don't think we can look at it because we don't have the unit. Um, they really should add a feature on the banner. Kind of like how they have in our Character Select thing. Uh, to watch the animation because I would definitely show it off here um, So there is that uh, So we have new ranking event. We have new story chapter Finally, which starts the war of underworld stuff and then lastly, let's go over. I haven't actually looked at this yet We have a Kirito resurrection campaign So let's look at what the resurrection campaign. So there's gonna be three total campaigns the first one is uh which, this is a spoiler, hopefully you've watched the episode before you've seen this video. I mean, this video is going out, you know, three or four hours, two or three hours after the episode aired. So hopefully people have seen it by now. If not, uh, then I apologize. Um, so, to cure, so to celebrate his resurrection, a login bonus where people can get Imaginarium will be held. Players who log in during the event period will get Kirito Evolution Crystals, Resurrection Imaginarium, specifically for Kirito. So, Resur Resurrection Imaginarium. Um, I'm not sure if that means it's going to be a specific Kirito that's going to be coming out or what, but I guess we'll see. Um, but just make sure you log in. So, it'll start with today's login to when the game resets here in like 12 hours or so. Uh, this is when it will start. So, it's just a three-day campaign. Uh, obviously, it's not going to go for too crazy long because by the time the next episode airs, we're going to see Kirito in action. By the way, for those who are, you know, wondering whether to summon for this Austin or not, I'm sure that, I don't want to say I'm sure, but I have a very high feeling that the next week's unit may be a Kirito. I don't know if he's going to be water um, because the, with this Austin, they've already broken the mold with her being water because up until this point, they did two banners of each color for enhanced mode. And we, I was kind of expecting they would just keep going until all the colors were done. But by making this Asuna water, now they can just do... That That doesn't necessarily mean they're going to do water and water back to back. They might just literally do this water charge Asuna. And then the new Kirito we get could be dark. Um, so I would not 
expect, you know, anything anymore. You know, anything can happen. So, um, this Resurrection Imaginarium, I presume, will probably be for the new Kirito that we're going to get. Um, the second part of the campaign is there's going to be an 11 times first time free Kirito Resurrection. Uh, that's a lot. It's a summon. Um, so, to celebrate, okay... Kirito's Resurrection Pickup Scout will be 11 times for free first time. Don't miss out this chance. I'm wondering if that means that... Okay, so that's from 817. Um, okay, so that's on Mon... Oh, that's... Yeah, that's Monday. So, I'm wondering if that's just going to be a general Kirito banner or what that's going to look like, but we'll see when that comes around. And then, same thing here. They're doing a weapon 11-time uh, pull... For that as well. I don't think we're going to get a new banner on Monday. Like, I don't think this Resurrection Kirito thing is going to be its own separate banner. Um, with a new unit. But, I mean, probably not because they're not even using, like, new artwork. Um, so that wouldn't really make too much sense there. But, uh, yeah. I think that's pretty much everything I just wanted. I just wanted to make this quick little video to go over the rest of the stuff that wasn't shown here. By the way, if you are going for Austin and you don't mind spending a bit of money, there are some new sale packs up, uh, which if I end up grabbing, I'll just save the crystals because there's really no reason for me to go for this Austin. Um, but yeah, so we got a new chapter. We got a new uh, campaign starting and we also have a new event. So plenty of crystals to uh, earn here. So definitely I recommend saving up for whatever you expect to happen i mean we, we still have some of the more hype moments to happen in the anime so i expect that the game will make units on that and hopefully the units will be better than this asana because her charge and assault skills not having additional effects is just that's like old uh rising steel and that kind of sucks but that's gonna be it guys thank you all for watching don't forget to subscribe for more if you're new to the channel i'll see you all next time have a wonderful day everyone